For the past 12 years, Sue Chamberlain's been swamped by the responsibility of being a mother of four. She's experimented with many hair colours with the result that her crowning glory looks like a Dulux paint chart. But the one thing that's ageing her more than anything is excessive facial hair. I've had this facial hair for 13 years almost since I had my first child and it is the most biggest thing that has been holding me back for a long, long time. She's asked for our help. But before we started, we put Sue on show in a crowded London street while 100 passers-by had a good hard look and answered the sensitive question, how old do you think this woman really is? About 40, I think. I think she's 44. 37. 45. My sort of age, which is sort of 40. 38. 48. I think she's 46. People guess Sue's age at anything between 25 and 50, but the average came out at 40. But I'm not going to show you the results, OK? It's difficult viewing, but Sue's prepared. She's in her early 40s, just judging by her skin, her hair, complexion, clothes. Oh, my clothes. <laughs> Sue's nervous laughter isn't fooling anybody. This hurts. Uh, I think she's about 44. <laughs> And the uh, oh, reason why I think that is because sort of like the lines around, uh, around her sort of chin and stuff, they're all quite good, I guess, Oh, my God. The colour of her hair, I guess, looks a bit strange. Doesn't exactly suit her face, I don't know. It makes her look older. The mat, the scarf, and the haircut's quite old-fashioned. The body language isn't very young either. <laughs> Just stood there like that. I think she's 47. Yeah, I think the trials and tribulations of life leave an indelible mark. That was some pretty hardcore stuff. I didn't like any of them. Well, Sue, so your average age from that poll yeah. came out at 40. How old are you really, Sue? 34. Wow. Now, I must say, my first impressions when I met you, when I saw you for the first time, um, I definitely thought you were late 30s, early 40s. Why do you think you look older than your years? It's a lot of time spent on being a mum mm. rather than being yourself, I suppose. Mm. 